à tous les DDO, attention pour le décompte final. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, top Allumage Vulcain. Allumage de ZAP, décollage. to call it the rumble in the Amazon jungle, and it really is as the mighty Ariane 5 ECA roars out toward Devil's Island. One of those bucket list events to have watching an Ariane 5 thunder into the sky from CSG. A minute into the launch, and the Ariane 5 has already broken the sound barrier here at Corvu. And this massive Jupiter facility, literally shaking, we can feel it now. 1,300 tons of thrust breaking the Ariane 5, free from the bonds of Earth's gravity. 90% of that power coming from the two boosters, each one 31 meters tall, burning 240 tons of solid propellant in two minutes. That that's better than two tons a second. When the boosters have done their job in a little less than a minute from right now, Ariane will be 70 kilometers into non, the sky. It'll be racing away from us at more than 1.6 kilometers a second, faster than a bullet. The information coming down to us at Gilat, the tracking station on a mountain just behind us here at the Jupiter facility. The next major event is the burnout and the jettison of those two solid rocket boosters. You're going to be able to see it live on the screen. It'll happen in about uh, 13 seconds from right now when those boosters have uh, completed uh, their job at uh, 2 minutes 20 seconds into the mission. So watch for that. And look at those pictures. In the clear skies above Karu, the boosters have uh, done their job. We don't need them anymore. Talk about losing weight. On the pad, Arian 5 was 774 tons, roughly. We're now down to 180 tons. And in the rocket business, when you get lighter, you go a lot faster. And there you see some video from a previous mission of uh, the rockets, uh, the boosters dropping away. Ariane 5 now closing in on 100 kilometers in the sky, traveling at 150, uh, make that uh, 2.8, uh, 2.1 kilometers uh, per second. Speed number tonight, by the way, 9.3 is the uh, magic number. Next up, the jettison of the fairing. It's protected the satellites from the elements on the ground. And in the early days of launch, early moments of launch, we don't need it anymore, and so very shortly, you are going to see and hear, there it is, on the animation. Separation de la coiffe. And the DDO has announced it. Here's uh, the fairing uh, dropping away from us. Uh, this